the horizontal situation indicator or HSI is comprised primarily of the heading indicator or compass and the course deviation indicator or CDI and is located in the lower center of the primary flight display or PFD. The compass is comprised of a 360 degree circle. East is 90 degrees, south is 180 degrees, west is 270 degrees, and north is zero or 360 degrees. There is a tick mark on the compass for every five degrees. So you have five degrees, 10 degrees, 15 degrees, 20, 25, 30, and so on all the way to 360 degrees. Every large tick mark is 10 degrees. So you have 10 degrees, 20 degrees, 30 degrees, 40, 50, 60, and so on. Again, all the way to 360 degrees. The HDG pop-up, which is short for heading, is where the heading bug is currently located. The top center box is the actual heading and the CRS box, which is short for course, reflects where the CDI needle is currently pointing. When you see the entire compass as a circle, it is considered to be in 360 mode. You can change this to what is called arc view mode by pressing the PFD soft key button, then the HSI format soft key, and then the arc HSI soft key. To go back to 360 mode, press the 360 HSI soft key. Click the back soft key until you get back to where you were. There are four tick marks at the top of the HSI and these represent rate of turn. The first tick marks to the right or left represent a half standard rate right or left turn, meaning you will turn 1.5 degrees a second or a total of 360 degrees in four minutes, if you are on one of those tick marks. The outer right or left tick marks mean you are doing a standard rate turn of three degrees in a second, or a completed 360 degree turn in two minutes. As you turn, you will see a magenta trend indicator. I'll do a right turn and notice when the magenta trend indicator gets to the first tick line, it is showing that I am now doing a half standard rate right turn. Now I'll turn to the left and when the magenta trend indicator gets to the second tick line, it is now showing I am doing a standard rate turn. There is more that can display on and around the HSI, but to keep things simple for now, I will cover that information in future videos as we go deeper into navigation. Subscribe to this channel to learn more.